Hey, what's up? So, I just had a little bit of a moment. I thought I'd left my camera at home and Lydia and I have just arrived here in Ireland to Dublin and I was looking for my camera everywhere and I found Lydia's. I was like, where's my camera? Lydia's only gone and nicked it and started doing a time lapse with it. So, <laughs> she flattened my battery and stole my camera. But anyway, we're back up and running. We've just arrived. We're here at the Westbury in Dublin and we're actually away because Lydia's doing a job with Brown Thomas, which is very conveniently just down the road. And my older brother lives with his fiance here and his three girls. It's the perfect opportunity for me to catch up with those guys. So they're gonna be heading down from Kells and they're gonna be coming out for dinner with us this evening. And I thought I need to pop out quickly and get the girls some Thing. just a little something because I haven't seen them this year which makes me an absolutely awful uncle and terrible godfather so Liz and I are gonna jump into Brown Thomas we're gonna have a little mooch around probably end up doing a little bit of shopping for ourselves as well and then we're gonna come back to the Westbury and head out for dinner at a place of the girls choice so before we go I thought I'd quickly show you the hotel room so as you can see we have a lovely suite here at the Westbury the four pillar posted bed which is exactly what we have at home so good times and before I leave the window this is our view we arrived to some lovely platters on the table and uh, I think this is like pink lemonade yes bosh Lydia hello sloffy and um, then we've got like the coffee station mini bar which I've not actually looked at yet oh snazzy it's like a vending machine almost dangerous and then I've obviously already unpacked all of my stuff I think I brought enough shoes with me for two days <laughs> and um, then this is the bathroom this is actually quite cool in here we've got the his and her sink which as you guys know I absolutely love and then through here we have an epic full-length three-way mirror now something I really like about this is when you go to hotel rooms you very rarely get decent mirrors here, you're spoiled for choice. It's good times. And then just to finish it all off, you've got the TV that you can watch from the bath with the remote there. Happy days. It would just be a bit of a struggle if you were on the toilet trying to watch the TV. So that is the uh, sweet tour here at the Westbury. Liz and I are gonna head out now. Liz is just finishing off doing her makeup. She's actually just launched a brand new makeup bag with Elizabeth Arden, and that's what she's been busy getting up to. Very proud of her. She's doing very well. And uh, have you got the bag with you? Uh, yes, I'm here. Have you it. can actually show it to me because even though it's technically not gone live yet, it's going to be live by the time this video is. Yeah. So here it is. So it's been squished in my suitcase, but it says Lydia Elise Millen for Elizabeth Arden on it. Can't really see it, it's a bit exposed, but. Can you see it now? Yep. So um, I designed the entire thing, like even the colours, the shape, the size, the lining, and the best bit you're going to see yourself now. But I really pushed for the best quality mirror Ooh. that there possibly could be. No wobbly mirrors. I wasn't going to have a wobbly mirror. No. So yeah, this is just... I'm like, nope, yeah, I know what you're talking about. <laughs> yeah. When you get like a really cheap yeah. mirror in and you, and Yeah, yeah, yeah. And it like... It's a good mirror. Yeah, no, so I even like... Because it's a gift with purchase, I couldn't have like a silver plaque. But actually, I, I prefer this now. So, but I, ha I went for the mirror instead of that. Yeah, so you chose to have a good quality mirror yeah. instead of having a silver plaque with your name on it. Yeah. So you went for the fabric plaque, and then you've got the good quality mirror inside. Yeah, yeah. So, they the, can, the, so it's actually practical and functional. Yeah, yeah. As well. For me, it was more important that it was like practical and functional yes. than like my ego. So, but actually, I prefer this more now. Yeah, so it's really nice. I don't mind. It's really nice. So yeah. Good times. Well done. Thanks, babe. You can put a link in the description box. <laughs> okay, I'll do that for you. <laughs> so this is the first time I've ever been in a lift that's got a chair in it. Living my best life. Ah, hee hee, Jamal, mother. Just came into Brown Thomas to look for some trainers for the girls, and they've got Gucci kicks for kids. That's amazing. Do you think Lids, Stan Smiths? Winners? Winners. Winner. Winners. <laughs> just arrived to Captain America, which is like a burger joint, I think, and the rest of the guys are just on their way over now. So we're gonna go inside, grab our table, and enjoy some food. There she is. Hello. How you doing, you right? Yeah. 
We've got two beds in it. Starters have arrived. Oh, you teaser. Yeah. What a teaser mummy is. Mummy teasing you. Stella completely teased her then. I'm sorry. You didn't even realise. Oh, that's a forgiveness look. It's all okay, it's in the mouth. That's so cute. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> You're so cute. Yes, you are. So I've gone for the big smoke with sweet potato fries. Stella's got the fish and chips. Did you get the big smoke. She's got happy ears. Oh, you've done yours quickly. You're not messing about. Nice runners. Like They're fresh. Fresh kit. They go with what you're wearing today, to be fair. <laughs> Wait, try to... Laces all right? How many runners can I have at home are filthy? Are filthy? Yeah. Well, they're white, so they're going to get filthy really easily. They're filthy because they're going to school for me. Yeah. We come to school to play on the edge. Yeah. And then we have lunchtime play on the edge. Yeah. So you play on the yard four times a day and then that's why you got filthy kicks. So you can wear these ones when you go up for dinner and then have your filthy ones for PE. Sound like a plan? Yeah. Good times. Bye. <laughs> Good so I just did that really embarrassing thing when you sleep for your alarm and then your breakfast room service arrives and you have to answer the door looking like you've been dragged through a bush backwards. We do have breakfast. It has arrived. Miss Bill and Gordon still in her bed, sleeping. But she ordered a cold breakfast. Nah, she ordered two eggs, I don't think. Um, but anyway, she ordered a cold breakfast, so she's going to chill a little bit longer. But last night was really nice. Um, see my brothers and his children, and of course Stella, his partner. It was so nice to see them because we haven't actually seen them this side of Christmas. So, yeah, that was a real treat. But today we have um, a day to ourselves, and then I think we're due some rain this afternoon. So we should really be getting up and out and enjoying Ireland before it rains. And then this evening we've got Lydia's event at Brown Thomas. Um, and so, yeah, that's the plan of action. So last night my brother's girlfriend told us that <laughs> Me and Lydia should go on the Viking tour bus. That was the Viking did tour you, bus. Did you see me on that tour bus? <laughs> <laughs> With my Viking hat. Stella, if you're watching this, that is definitely... We are never taking your advice. <laughs> Not us. <laughs> finally got dressed and out of the room. We went and actually explored a little bit around Dublin and it was so cold that we were like rushing around. We didn't want to get our cameras out because we could hardly feel our hands. Lydia was like, I can't even operate my phone. You didn't let me, so, you wouldn't let me open it. My phone was so cold. So we've headed back to the hotel here, the Westbury, and uh, we've grabbed some food. We grabbed some lunch actually at the sidecar and it's just arrived. It looks amazing. We've got sweet potato fries truffle fries, chicken sticks, and it's gone for like a club sandwich, but I think it's like their club sandwich. Feeling a lot warmer now, feeling better babe. She's happy with her truffle fries. Mm -hmm. So Lydia and I finished off at lunch, which was delicious. I feel very naughty these last past days. We've had some absolutely horrendous food, and I don't mean that as in bad, I just mean it as in uh, bad for the physique. I just thought I'd quickly show you my outfit because we're just about to head to Brown Thomas for Lydia's event this evening and uh, I've done something a little bit different today. I've actually gone all blue. I don't normally go navy head to toe but I have today. I've started off with a blue Zara t-shirt, just a plain t-shirt, Reese navy oversized coat and then the trousers I picked up from Zara as well and they've got this really nice elasticy fabric in them. They fit really well around the ankle which was nice you can see and then these are my new Oliver Sweeney kicks in navy suede so yeah and then I've just accessorized with the gold pendant from crafted London so that's this evening's look a little bit different but I'm liking it I think Lydia's just finished off getting ready there she is and um, we're gonna head down now meet the guys from Brown Thomas and then get busy with the event I'm always nervous before these things though you are, you'll be fine, you'll always smash it. Lily could talk the ass of a donkey. <laughs> That's actually very true. Yeah, it is true. <laughs> Believe in you again.
Should be nice. It's on our way out for dinner. Ali has I'm vlogging. Hey guys. <laughs> he was vlogging the traffic lights. Yeah, we're going to go here. 777. That's where we're going for dinner. <laughs> yeah, she's booked us. This is the uh, starter. It's looking banging. Margarita out here. You hungry? I'm, I haven't had anything since breakfast. Wow. <laughs> I need a coffee now. <laughs> well, hopefully this will fill a yeah, hole. This will. I think you ordered enough for the whole restaurant, Ali. We went in. Lydia and I have just finished off with Grace. Face is by Grace. Grace is by face. Grace is by face. <laughs> Very lovely spending the evening with her. She's such a sweetheart. But I'm going to go back to the hotel now. Grab one more drink to in see our us bedroom, off. Though. Yeah, in our bedroom to see off the evening. And uh, yeah, we'll be seeing you guys in the morning. Uh, tomorrow we've got no plans, which is great because it means we're going to have a little lay in. And then uh, I think we, we might head. Sloth. You can. Professional sloppy. Professional sloppy. And then, um, yeah, and I think we're going to go back to uh, Brown Thomas because shopping is uh, very much needed. So we'll see you guys in the morning. Ooh, out of focus. There she is. Good morning. So last night was lovely. We had um, a dinner with Grace and uh, Lids at like a Tex-Mex place called 777, as I probably did say last night. And uh, it was quite different, wasn't it? It was nice, it's what I was looking for. I wanted something that wasn't kind of like burger joint-esque and it's exactly what we got. This morning we're gonna check out at Westbury and it's been an absolutely glorious day. So big thank you to the guys for looking after us here. And uh, we're gonna head back over to Brown Thomas because we're gonna do a little bit of shopping. So. Lids is all ready. Howdy ho! Howdy ho, partner. Down the bottom, we've got the suitcases packed by the door, ready to go. Room's kind of been put back to a relatively decent state. And uh, yeah, we're gonna go shopping. I think I'm gonna shop for some shoes. Lydia's gonna shop for some clothes and bags and whatever else she gets up to. So let's get busy. Right, so I've just spent the last hour here at Brown Thomas shopping and I've selected a few pieces that I'm gonna be trying here at the personal shopping area in store. Let's take a look. Um, so the first things I went for some trainers. So these are actually a new release from Adidas, Derupt Runners. They look really cool, quite vibey. 
and uh, I think I could wear these in and out of the gym to be fair very summery and then I've got the Condi Garcon Converse I think you can just wear these all year round and uh, yes hopefully they're gonna fit nicely and then these bad boys from Dolce and Cabana um, I've wanted a pair of these for a very long time and I saw them in store today and I tried them on with my navy trousers they look amazing so I think I'm probably gonna pick these up but I brought them up to get Lydia's opinion on them I've got a play Condi Garcon t-shirt in white and then this is just like a white t-shirt shirt that is going to be used for layering um, so we're going to see how that fits because it's all they had in store at the moment Hey. <laughs> and then um, I've got a lot of summer trips coming up so I thought it's about time I got a nice pair of swim shorts so I've got two types I've got the D&G swim shorts as you can see here in a navy and then in a black um, I think I'm actually a size three and I think they've only got size four here so we're gonna see how they fit hopefully they fit okay um, and then again the thumb brown absolutely love this brand but I've still yet to purchase an item from them but these are another pair of navy swimming shorts with obviously the signature detailing down the side stuff from the cupels that I'm gonna be trying on which is uh, this is like a guitar print shirt but it's in like a really nice gray bluey color um, which I think I'm gonna get a lot of wear out of so we're gonna try that on and then this is a brand that I've never heard of before it's called Dries Van Norton. Have you ever heard of it, babe? Yeah. And uh, it's got like the zip detailing with the collar. I don't know. I just kind of think it looks quite luxury, quite nice. So we're going to give that a spin. Finally, we have trousers. We've got some really nice sort of khaki trousers from the Cooples that are kind of turned up at the bottom. I think these are going to fit really nicely and then I have some sort of like washed khaki Gucci trousers um, these are actually what the personal shopper picked out for me to try on so be interesting to see how they fit and then finally something I struggle with a lot is denim so I've got a couple of pairs of page denim here that we're gonna try and a brand called seven yes for all seven mankind yeah gonna see how those fit as well the fabrics so soft and stretchy I got the denim from mankind jeans as well. Did you? Yeah. Today? Yeah. Yeah, they're really soft fabric, aren't they? Yeah. So, softy, softy. Softy, softy. I do like the trousers. I think that they've got um, a nice, smart look to them. Um, I'm not too keen on the crotch on these. I feel like the crotch is a little bit too low. And, um, yeah, there's something that just, just slightly catches on my knee on the inside. And they kind of, like, rise. Um... So although they're very nice, my body shape doesn't agree with them. just finished off trying all the clothes here in Brown Thomas and I've made a decision I know what I'm gonna pick up um, I'm gonna go for the navy blue Dolce & Gabbana swim shorts now these were like I said a size too big for me but they actually fitted really nicely everywhere else uh, other than the waist but because they've got the drawstring um, they're good enough to be able to tighten up and uh, they won't slip off when I dive into the pool which is always a good thing um, and then the second pick up today are gonna be these D&G kicks which is just absolutely beautiful. I'm gonna go for this plain white t-shirt from Hanro. Um, it's quite pricey for a white t-shirt, yeah, 46 euros, but the quality of it is second to none. And uh, I do really struggle to pick up nice white t-shirts. So that's gonna go down really nicely and get a lot of wear. So happy to pay for it. And then last but not least, I'm gonna get these Condi Garcon Play Converse trainers uh, from the offspring section here at Brown Thomas. These are absolutely timeless in my opinion. I've seen these around for so long now and they're not going anywhere. So yeah, these are gonna be another pickup today. And that's it. That's the uh, shopping trip successfully done. <sighs> Are you happy now I'm finished? I already got mine. You did. Congrats. I already did my shopping. You did. What did you get? A dressing gown with pockets? <laughs> I wish. Liz <laughs> and I just got to the airport here in Dublin, and you know you're in Ireland, the busiest place in the airport is the pub. <laughs> but um, I thought this would be a very fitting time to finish off the video. So I just want to say a massive thank you to Brown Thomas for having us over and the Westbury for such great hospitality. If you have enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up. And if you're not subscribed, make sure you click that subscribe button. We'll be seeing you on the next one. Peace.